Hi, welcome to another demonstration video for the Triangle Project. Today we're looking at scratching. It's a very simple technique, but a lot of fun. You'll just need a few simple materials, um, some oil pastels if you have them. You can get those at the dollar store typically, or crayons work as well. Uh, your template and something to scratch with. I've used a barbecue skewer and a popsicle. So starting with your template again, you can use any paper again, make it into paper and cut your triangles or use our template, turn it over, and then what you're going to do is you're just adding um, the oily pastel or the waxy crayon onto the paper to create something to, uh, to scratch out of. So oil pastels are fabulous because they really um, blend, the colors are vivid. You're just going to go ahead and uh, fill that um, template at the back there where the triangles are. And you're just, I'm just randomly having fun scratching. I'm using three different colors here. You can use uh, um, any colors, as many colors. So that first color you put down will kind of stain the paper a little bit or whatever is actually touching the white and then you can keep, kind of keep layering keep blending the colors until you get something you like and again you can very relaxing you can just do this um, while you're watching TV even um, just blending the colors creating um, some building up of the material that you will then scratch from. And although this is sort of preparing the paper, uh, it can be really fun. You want to just um, scribble away, layer, blend those colors together, see how um, they, they mix together. Interesting with different, I'm using a red, orange, yellow kind of a mix for this one, but um, you can absolutely use any colors and just um, work them over top of each other to blend them, go back and forth, uh, kind of relaxing actually. And you, um, if you want a high contrast in your scratching, then you have to think about that when putting on um, yellow on the white won't produce um, a very high contrast so your line work is going to be super subtle. Um, I would recommend um, going fairly high contrast with whatever paper color you choose and layering also helps you get some depth in there and you get a little variety in um, the line you end up with in um, color. So uh, just going around and filling in that whole template. I can see through the paper to where those edges fall. So I'll get four triangles out of this. And uh, all right, so once you're done, cut out your triangle and you've got your base to scratch from. I'm taking just a wooden barbecue skewer from Dollar Store. And I am just randomly going to do sort of line work. Uh, you can see it's uh, you're um, using a subtractive method so you're taking something out or off um, to create this piece. Uh, first you added and now you're subtracting. And it's just really fun to see the line come out with your um, skewer. The super thin line. Um, you can use a variety of tools. Um, if you want a thicker line, see how that popsicle stick works really well. You kind of want that edge. And you're just basically scraping off. You can see it's a little thicker. A little more comes off. It can be a little messy. You get little bits of the oil pastel that come off. It's kind of really fun to um, carve out, basically. Now, just wanted to show you um, what it would look like if you use uh, a different colored paper. You don't have to use white. I've used black actually, Bristol board, and used the oil pastel and you can see that's a super thin subtle line and I just went crazy scribbly all over um, to uh, create sort of a pattern. 
random pattern and now I'm going to go in and just um, pull out some of those lines with my popsicle stick to get a thicker line. Just kind of fun. I'm not really worrying too much about um, what it looks like. I'm doing something a little more abstract and then I can go back in and make a few lines I like. I'll pull out the design from those uh, marks that I initially made. Just kind of really fun. You can see you can the black paper comes through a little more. Okay, I hope you enjoyed that demonstration on scratching. Um, super simple, but you can uh, get some really cool, interesting results. Thanks for watching.